Hello everybody, it's Tanya from Tolly Day's Nursery and I figured I would do a changing video for you. This is Corbin. Corbin was dressed as a boy until someone came to pick out some dolls um, because they live local, so <clears throat> they drove a little bit, but they came to pick out a doll for someone for Christmas. And um, to show them how this doll would look dressed as a girl, then I put this outfit on. Um, but I think Corbin is a beautiful looking little girl as well as boy, so can go as either. Um, needs to tame down that hair a little bit, but that is just a cute, cute baby right there. And uh, so I figure I will change her or him, but I'm going to change this, uh, this doll into another girl outfit. Um, I do want to let you know that I have five reborns currently available um, and so I had hoped they'd be gone home in time for Christmas um, tomorrow is the first of December ho 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 <laughs> um, and so I they're they're ready to ship um, as soon as I get full payment, they can be shipped out. They can come with a box opening uh, because I have loads of supplies here. And um, yeah, so I'm just flicking through birth certificates here right now, trying to find the one for Corbin. Um, Corbin weighs five pounds and two ounces. So, you know, not overly heavy, but comfortable to hold. Uh, it's a three-quarter limb body, so, you know, you have that flexibility and um, even to, you know, sit and pose them, uh, it's great for that. So, and for anybody younger who uh, is dressing them, I find it gives more flexibility for a smaller child or younger person who is not quite used to dressing or undressing a baby that um, these three-quarter limb dolls really help them learn I think um, on how to uh, dress and undress the dolls so um, anyway this one is available I'm going to do some videos uh, this is Saturday evening so <laughs> I'm running out of Saturday but um, I'm hoping to do a few more videos to get them up and show the ones that I have available right now. Um, Christmas is still a little bit away, so uh, pretty much anywhere Canada and U.S. Uh, from here in Newfoundland, shipping takes about seven to eight days. So if anybody would like to purchase uh, one of these Reborns that are ready to go, then... Uh, in about a week you would have it so therefore um, you know it's something that anybody who's interested in uh, adopting one of these reborns really need to get uh, on the ball <laughs> and jump on it because time is running out so oh, there's a snowflake I'm trying to pick off <laughs> um, so Corbin is 21 inches and weighs five pounds and three ounces. Um, I think this outfit is a zero to three month. Let me see here. Yes, so that's a Carter's zero to three months. So I'm going to take this outfit off. She's got her cute reindeer diaper on. Um, and they will come with a special Christmas outfit because I did purchase... Oops, I did purchase the outfits uh, for them for the um, Christmas at the Glacier um, event that I had all these dolls made for. 
so you can see the nice detail, the toes. I love the toenails and the fingernails on this kit. They are done so nice. And I'm sure you've heard me over and over saying on my channel how much I appreciate nice, oops, nice toenails and uh, fingernails. So, so you don't have to be guessing where the nail beds are. But these are some cute little piggies right there. I got my flash on because it's dark. Oh, we're to that time of year. Of course, my lighting is never great, but I do have pretty good lighting in my nursery right now. And, uh, you can, oh, there it is. You can see the veins. Um, and I just love the texture. Let me see if I can see it here. I can see it from my angle, but you can't pick it up on the on the screen. The texture looks like pores, like actual skin. I really like how I did that. So I figured that one out, and I'm really excited to be doing that layer on all my dolls. And... Uh, I love giving gorgeous um, veins. Veins to me are very important. Um, just like well-rooted hair, I maybe I'm just too meticulous about it. I, you know, I like. To, I guess I, I just try to have it too perfect. But you know, anybody who's spending their money on a reborn doll. And spending three hundred plus dollars, well, you know they want they want their money's worth. Obviously, they don't want to receive something and say, "Oh my gosh, I got scammed." I don't ever want to hear that from anybody who would receive a doll from me because I spend so much time trying to get everything perfect. Now Harley's out there banging his dish for food. Of all times. <laughs> of all times. Didn't make a sound the whole evening. Just laid around in his tent. And now he's banging his dish that I'm on the camera. <laughs> Just always has to start right at that time. So, we're going to put this little outfit on. This... Onesie doesn't go with it, but she do need a onesie on. So, and I love that, that one hand with the one finger sticking. I was like, I'm telling you, <laughs> one more time. <laughs> do I have to tell you one more time? <laughs> I can picture a little baby now mimicking. The pointing finger <laughs> but this face is gorgeous just gorgeous I love the lips it has a little tiny dimple here and I love that I love dimples so I'm gonna put Minnie Mouse she's gonna wear Minnie Mouse and uh, She's got long legs. <laughs> I find long legs. Let's give you some more room. <laughs> now, let's see. I'd, I'd be happy to keep all of them, but, you know, when you're spending, you're, you're, when you have expenses to make them, you can't keep every single one. <laughs> And I tend to go overboard a little bit, so I really don't get my money, money's worth back, but I do like to do a nice box for people and 
that's important to me. It's important to me that people are pleased with what they get. And I don't think anybody will complain about ever getting too much. <laughs> I don't think, anyway. So this little outfit fits her. This is a three, zero to three month as well. Gorgeous. I do like her as a girl more than a boy, I think. It's like when I put a girl outfit on, I was like, oh yeah, all girl. <laughs> all girl. She's gorgeous. But mind you, the minute you put a boy outfit on, then you get that kind of uh, resemblance of a, a boy. So that's the great thing about um, the Reborn dolls. At least my experience is <laughs> um, you can get away with that. As long as they don't have a billy plate. I don't know if it's just a mental thing for me. Like with Little Smile, I feel that that one just fools me to, to think that he's a, it's a boy. Of course, I created Little Smile to be a boy as well. So that kind of... I'm looking for a little headband now. Let's see if I can... I've given away so many headbands because I buy them to go with outfits and then when I'm wrapping the outfits up I put the headbands with them I don't hold on to them you know I just like giving it all away that's not the right pink I don't seem to be able to find one. I just had some in my hand. Let's put a silver one on. She's got a gray silver color in her. In her shirt. Oops. There we go. I can't even hold on to it. So I have a, a Black Friday special on, on all the dolls that I have available right now. So I have five available, six including, oops, sorry, including Little Smile. Um, and so it's a spectacular price that I have on. Um... So for all five that are available, uh, it's two fifty USD. So basically in Canada, that's three fifty, um, and it's free shipping. So I will ship to Canada or US. Outside of Canada and US, it would be the responsibility of the buyer. Um, of course. I contribute $40 USD to the shipping. So if it's more than $40 shipping, then the buyer would be responsible for the, the balance of it. Um, so it's this one. This is Corbin. And I have Juliet as a AA baby. I have... Um, Aisha as a biracial AA baby. I have Fagin is gorgeous. Um, and Kyle is another one. I haven't changed Kyle yet into a girl outfit. Uh, he's still in, in a little Santa outfit. So he'll be up next to see how he <laughs> measures on uh, the changeover from male to female. Um, so... All five of those are the same price. They're they're two fifty USD, or for Canadians, uh, three fifty Canadian, and it's free shipping as well as um, a box opening. 
And your headpan just went back over your head. <laughs> um, it's, it's tied a little bit too tight. So, um, those are available at that price. I have Little Smile. Little Smile is still available. Um, and he is 600 Canadian. Uh, free shipping to Canada and U.S. Um, but for the Black Friday sale, which is soon going to be over, I've been advertising it on my Facebook page as well as um, Instagram. Um, Black Friday event will be over uh, Sunday night, tomorrow night at 11.59 p.m. Newfoundland time. And um, so Little Smile, uh, until then, will be 500 Canadian. Um, and for the U.S., that's 400. So 400 U.S. for Little Smile. And he is a very limited um, kit by Phil Donnelly. Um the contest entry baby that I submitted at uh, the Rose Doll Show in Utah. And um, there's only 204 worldwide of that kit. So very limited. Um, so basically the same rule with that one. Um, a box opening... Uh, free shipping to Canada and U.S. Um, outside of Canada and U.S., the buyer would be responsible for the shipping price. And um, I would contribute $40 USD to that. Or, well, Canadian $50. So, that is Corbin. So, anybody who is interested... Uh, and would like to have one of these babies for Christmas, um, please let me know as soon as possible so we can make arrangements. You can get your payment into me um, through PayPal. I do also have my Square um, system, and so that means that not only in person, but um, over the phone, uh, I wouldn't do it over the computer. You would not want to give any of your information online. Uh, you would have to call me and um, pay, but you could pay through Visa, MasterCard, or American Express. So those are three new options that I have uh, through that Square uh, payment um, system that I have. So... If you're interested and you'd like to bring one of these home for Christmas or gift it to someone that you know, um, please let me know and um, we'll get that all worked out for you. So, there is sweet Corbin. I think she's gorgeous. <laughs> she's so gorgeous. She's got one hand that's closed in a fist. And the other hand is partially closed with her one finger saying, I told you so. You waited too long. I told you so. <laughs> anyway, talk to you later, everybody. Thank you for joining me. And we will see you soon with another baby. Bye-bye.